And you started on one today, right? Yeah. I thought so. Yep. All right, here with Lauren Stevenson, a quality first round out here at the Chevron Championship. Just take me through how you're feeling after day one. I feel great. Um, had a fun walk this morning, really enjoyed the conditions and played some really solid golf. I went bogey free, so I uh, can't complain when that happens. feel uh, really good about the day. You started off hot with that two birdies in a row. What was going right on mm. numbers one and two? Oh, you know, I put myself in good position. I had two wedges in my hand, so I uh, had two kind of short looks at birdie. And um, usually sometimes on the first hole, you kind of want to just take it easy. But I was like, I need to go ahead and like try to make this one. So it's always nice to start off with some positive momentum. You were talking about Golf Channel. This is one of your favorite courses. What's it like returning to this place and just being able to see these conditions in the way that they are? You just feel so lucky. I feel like when you know you're coming here, and especially this year for the last time, it's almost like just enjoying the, these last walks because it's such a special course. I don't know what exactly makes it so special. The conditions are amazing and the views are amazing and all the people are amazing, but it's just such a fun place that I think every single player enjoys coming to, and we just all feel so grateful to be here. What's that major championship mindset like for you? Maybe that differs from a week-to-week -week basis. Um, I think major championships, it's easier to stay steady. It's easier to stay positive, to stay patient. It's easier to do all those things because you know, I mean, except Cup Cho today, you know no one's like usually <laughs> running away with it. So um, it's easier to just kind of hang in it, even if you have some tough shots or tough holes. It's just the mindset for me is a little bit easier to manage versus I know I have to shoot nine under every day. And I know you said cup show right now with yeah. a strong lead, but yeah. you still being able to finish bogey free. How important is that for you as you head into Friday? Yeah, um, it's so important. I mean, I didn't chip one time today, so I had the few greens I missed. I was just putting off the fringes. So I know my ball striking is there and I I know if I could have hold a few more putts, I could have been eight under as well. So I'm um, just really happy with the round and taking those good vibes into tomorrow. And one last one for me, but you talked about a little bit of your you know, major mentality. One of, the, one of the times we've seen you in contention was, of course, that T9 finish at the KPMG Women's yeah. PGA Championship. How much do you take away from experiences like that that you think can help you in this kind of moment? Um, I mean, anytime you're playing well in a major or any tournament, it just gives you confidence. And that's what it's all about out here. You got to believe at the end of the day, you got to believe in yourself and no one can believe in you for you. You got to step up to that tee and know that you can play. So I think that's the key to having good finishes is just building that confidence. All right. Bethany, you have anything? <laughs> I don't know what you asked. What do you love the most about this place? I don't know. I was just saying it's so amazing, but it's like everything's amazing. The conditions are amazing. The course is amazing. The people here are amazing, like the community. Just everything about this tournament and surrounding this course is just like happiness. Like you mm. just feel like so lucky to be here. What traditions do you hope carry on? Um, definitely jumping in the pond. You know, that, that's a special one for us. So um, I think that's something like as a little girl, you like watch and you want to like replicate that. Um, so I'm sure that they could somehow carry that over. <laughs> Maybe it's not Poppy's Pawn, but at least uh, it could be a similar tradition. But all the history here, too, just you can feel it like when you're walking around. It's just really special. Cool. Perfect. All right. Thank, Thank you, Lauren. Thanks, guys.